Okay, I'm ready. Hi, we're here with an alumni from Baxter University. Hi, my name is Amanda. I've graduated from Baxter University in 2012. So Amanda, how did you hear about Baxter University? Uh, at first, uh, I met your team in my high school uh, here in Poznan. It was a great experience because from the first time you just came with your team, you showed them the university. It was like a big presentation. It was very nice because I could ask all the questions, you know, about studying in England, how to do it, you know, how to get there. And it was just, I actually made a decision in like 10 minutes with your team. <laughs> and so, what course? You studied journalism? Yes, journalism. Did you enjoy the course? I loved the course. Um, mainly because um, all the great people that I met in my course and everybody was kind of doing their own thing, different thing in the field of journalism and it really helped me to find what I wanted to do professionally because when I came to university I thought that I would be like a typical journalist like going into writing mm -hmm. and then I had amazing tutors who actually told me after a year that maybe it's not, I'm not that good <laughs> in writing which I really valued because they actually showed me that my field was more into like filming and they said maybe look at this because you show some skills to do with filming and they really made my life easier because of that because now I can work in that field. Oh, great. So you had good relationships, you made lots of friends at university. Yes, yes. And <laughs> so I really value that the international environment that we had at the university and at the same time students from England as well who are really like, we are close friends till now. We meet every few months as oh, nice. much as we can, you know, to, to kind of, you know, remember how, how it was to be together at uni. Remembering the good times of student life. Yeah, I wish we could go back. <laughs> cool. So Amanda, where did you live when you were in university? Did you stay in the student accommodation? Uh, yes, we stayed in student halls um, in Brook Street, uh, in my case, uh, for my first year. And then from the second year on, we rented a house together with my friends. Actually, the same friends that we stayed in the flat at uh, student halls. Oh. So. so you make friends first year, then you live with them again yes. for the rest of your university? Yes, we spent the whole three years together. It's <laughs> nice. Were you part of any societies or did you do some sports at university? Uh, yes, I did some sports. I joined the gym at the university, thanks to Big Deal at that time. Okay, so I've joined the gym, uh, some yoga classes, things like that, because I'm into those activities. I was also an international editor for the Bucks in the newspaper at that time, so that was a great experience as well. Unfortunately, I didn't take my time to join any societies, and now I'm sorry I didn't. <laughs> and did you have a part-time job when you were at university as well? Yes, of course. Uh, I worked every afternoon just after my classes, and it was very like easy as well to find a local back then. So I could. I think it was very easy to kind of, you know, the university and have a part-time job at the same time because my parents like, couldn't support me financially. And yeah, that wasn't a problem at all. I really didn't. So would you recommend Polish students going to Bucks in the university? If they have a choice between Bucks and any other university here, I wouldn't even think. I would say go to Bucks, sure. <laughs> it was the best three years of my life. Great. Nice to meet you, Amanda. <laughs>